Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I will show a simple way how we can easily use DocuSign. So when you're going to enter DocuSign, you just want to simply drop documents here to get started, click on it and just upload your document. Right when you're going to do it, it's finishing, we can click next and just choose I'm only signer. And now recipients, you can edit or if you don't have any recipient here, just go back and I'm on the only signer, sign. Right, when you're gonna do it. Let's wait until it's going to load. Okay, please read the documents below, continue. So we see document is in Slovak language and now we have fields here. So you can add signature, so I'll scroll down below. I can put the sign here. This is the first thing that we will do. Then we have initials that you can, let's say that add it right here. MK, you see it right here. You can adapt an initial. You can drop it if you want to. Then you have stamps here again. And you can name, enter your name. Let's go with. Or you can go to upload. Or you can create your own. Look at this. Then you have date and sign, like when it was going to be signed. You can add a name, like my own. Or you can even rename it. Quite simple, quite easy. Then what you can do is to add a first name, last name and email address. Again, same style. Right? Company, title, text, and checkbox. Now, you can zoom in. You can download it. You can print it. You can rotate it left, rotate it right. And add a comment. So, let's say that we are going to sign this document. So, I will just easily add signature. I can draw even. Adapt and sign. You can this right here. Nice. Right here we got it. Then I can simply add a signature again. And voila, here you got it, right? Perfect sign. I, I can I have already died sign, but I can add stamp or initials. And look at this, right? Beautiful, right? And this is pretty much it how we do it. Now what you can do is to download it, combine PDF, and look at this. So this is the first way how we can do it. But first, when we do a sign, we need to click finish here. Full name. gmail.com send and close and now as you can see we got it here in the inbox you can also download it by yourself and I just got the email here that I can review the document see look at this so this is how we get the document if you're going to sign it. And when you're going to review the document, you can see it here. And voila, here we got a sign. So this is how we can use DocuSign. And it's quite simple and quite easy. You can also download it if you want to. And you can combine all PDFs into one file. Then choose a template, resending the same envelopes. Try templates. You can create a template here and you get also reports here. And I'm going to upload it again. Now placeholder can be next. 
and voila here you got it so this is the same thing that you just can add the fields to your template and really play around it with the drawing formulas attachments notes approved decline you got custom fields that you can add by yourself, markup tools, and really play around with your template and with your fields here. Click next. And now fields show you receive where to sign or enter information. So we can go like with, okay, I need sign here. Then I need a name or name here, right? And I need company name here. And you can move it as much as you want. You can change the formatting and everything here. And click next. And voila, here we got it. So this is our template that we, we can send to someone. So we can easily just click save template. Save and close. And see here. And now When you got it, I can simply go and move it, create a copy or use it. And who do you need it from to sign? Needs to sign, you just add here the name and email. And this is pretty much it, how you use DocuSign. It's not really difficult to use it. And I believe that right now we know exactly what to do. If you have any questions, guys, ask me down in comments. And yep, have a great day and goodbye. See ya. And you just send it to someone.